and uh, constantly were on alert. And we would see submarines around. The, and, and it seemed, as I experienced sailing around the east coast of the United States and down to the different places, they would hang off Boston, the Cape. They would hang off New York Harbor. In fact, I used to tell people, as soon as you step out, we were fighting off New Jersey. We were fighting off a submarine out here, off Barnegat. And then as you come to Philadelphia, the estuary, the Delaware estuary, and you keep on going, they were around there. The Florida Keys and around mouth of Mississippi River, Galveston, all that. They, they, they were nowhere else but there because they knew the ships had to go in and out of those places. And, uh, and, and, and they, they, they would get up at night and they, you could hear them on their diesel engines because they're trying to charge up their batteries. But we were so fast, they could never keep up with us. They could never. And when we got to Panama, then we had to get the repairs on the ship. It was amazing what happened. As we swung, they just kept on shooting us and shell holes all over. And there was one that we didn't find. It was about a foot and a half above the water line. But they found it when they got into the dock. It was there. and. Uh, so nobody was hurt, nobody was wounded or that, but we fired our guns at them. And these ships were not built to have guns firing, so we ended up with a problem with our steering engine. So they had to rebuild it in Panama for us. And as we went along, people, we got these young men from these schools, it was amazing. They were high school graduates, most of them had a high school education. And they were able to grasp everything because they come from farms and they had mechanical aptitudes and that. Even the instructors were telling us, it's amazing, these kids, even when they come out of Kentucky and out of the hills, they were able to use their hands and work and do things. And they could understand. And I say, that was the thing that won our war. <laughs>